I had to drag an object from one project to another in both Photoshop and Photopea. So we've talked about this before, but just kind of as a review, if I'm in Photoshop, which is what I've got pulled up now, um, and let's say that I've got my move tool and I've got two items, uh, I've got a picture and then I've got this that I want to bring over to the picture. Uh, let's say I want to go ahead and take this background off now. So since I'm in Photoshop, I have to unlock my background and then I can utilize my background eraser. So um, you can use the background eraser or what's cooler in Photoshop is the magic eraser. So I'll use my magic one. And then we just give it a click on each corner and there it is. Now, if I want to drag this over to the other, I can go up here to my view menu um, and I cannot view my window menu and I can come up here and arrange them. So I can put them both two up. That means two of them on the screen at the same time. Or let me put that back. Let me put them all back in tabs. Or I can just drag one of them down there. So I'm dragging the little one down. And then in Photoshop, we can just take the move tool and drag it straight across like so. Oops. And then hit this. Or, and again, notice I'm clicked in this picture right now, but I'm going to click back to this one. And then my layers are showing this one. Or I can just grab a hold of the layer itself from down here in the layers panel and pull it in. All right. And then it pulls it in. Now this one's on its own little layer in here. Okay. So you can do it one of two ways in Photoshop. In Photopea, we usually have to um, like select it all. So here I have that same document. I'm going to use a different eraser this time because we have a background eraser, but we don't have a magical eraser uh, in this program. However, I'm going to zoom up because we can still use the other eraser pretty well. Um, just remember about the middle part of your eraser needs to be touching the white, but you can let your eraser overlap your edges. So there it goes. I need the middle part to touch the white part so that I can delete it. There we go. So it takes a little bit more work, but like it's not too complicated. Not too bad. Oops. And just control Z if you need to back up a step. Okay. So there we go. There might be a little part here at the top, but I'm okay with it. Okay. So now same thing. We have the background layer, but we cannot undock. Like we can't pull this down. It, they don't, it doesn't let us in Photopea. What we can do though is drag the layer. So if I want to put that on this picture, same thing as Photoshop, I can come over here and just drag this layer and drop the layer into the other document. And then there it is. And then now I can take my move tool and I can put it in there. And if I still needed to touch it up, I could do that. Now in later chapters, we'll have layer masks. So um, where you're hiding parts of layers, they look different, but it's the same concept. I can take this and just drag that layer and drop it into wherever I want it to go. And then it'll be there. And that's it. So that's basically the dragging method to get something from one document to another.